Hello, welcome to everyone in this video. This is part 3 of the solution uh, of semester 6 2022 digital system and application paper. You can see this is the total paper and this portion that is question number 1 discuss in first part and question number 2 and 3 discuss in second part and this is third part. In this question we want to discuss this question number 4 and 5. In the upcoming session we will be discussing question number 6 and 7. So let's start question number four. A says that draw the circuit uh, diagram of JK flip from and explain its operation using a sequential table. So you can see that is a, a circuit diagram of a JK flip flop. Uh, uh, this is actually the SR flip flop. Uh, flip flop. Uh, this is known as the latch circuit. Latch means the output uh, in, inputted into the input side output uh, input into input side is called latch circuit and this latch circuit gives you a flip-flop circuit when there is a sequential manner so this is actually a search flip-flop and if you uh, uh, converted this outputted into the sr circuit this gives you jk flip-flop so if you consider this condition if you wants to know about the two treble this is actually two treble so when this n, a, n means nth uh, input so when this j, j, j is 0 k is 0 then what happened then if you consider this q n as a 0 so what happened this is 0 and this is 1 so this is 0 this is 0 so this becomes 0 and this is 0 but this is 1 but no, say, hence this is 0 so these two are 0 you need to remember this clock must be 1 this output table is called must be 1 so these two are 0 and uh, 0 means this is 1 this is 1 this is 1 these both are 1 uh, these both are 1 uh, and this is 0 this is 1 so this 0 and 1 means 0 so this is zero and this is qn is zero so zero zero multiply one so it satisfy and one zero multiply zero so this must be uh, one that is uh, you take this output what happened you just consider that is q uh, this condition you take qn zero qn bar is 1 so this is 0 this is 0 so if you consider this is 0 0 0 is multiply 0 inverse is 1 1 0 is 0 multiplied by this is 1 so this will be changed but when take this uh, qn 1 this is 0 since this is 1 so 1 0 is 0 is 1 and this 1 1 is 0 so this gives you no change in the output uh, when take this uh, j is 1 and this is 0 what happened uh, this j is 1 and k is 0 and qn is 0 q n bar is 1 so this is 0 so this 0 and this 0 becomes this is 0 and this is 1 this is 1 becomes this is 1 so this one and this zero this one and one means this is one and this is zero this is one this is zero you just write down this this is one this is zero okay now this qn is zero and this is one so take this zero so this zero zero is one and this one 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 zero so is one but if you reverse this is one this is zero this is one this is zero this becomes uh, sir zero so this become q actually i just remove this one so you just carefully look into this to treble you will obtain finally this type of uh, output okay so this is actually in the jk flip flop and you need to write down this phenomena uh, that is the uh, uh, that is the simplified to treble that is j n uh, k n and this is q n plus 1 
so when j n uh, k n is zero this become q n when this is one this is zero this is one this is zero this is one and this is one this become zero and this is one this is one this is q n bar okay this is last value and this is uh, you can say set set it set the value and this is reset reset value and this is struggle okay struggle so these are the uh, operational output of jk flip flop okay next things is that they implement a deep flip flop using jk flip flop you can see in case of uh, 0 0 and 1 1 there is a sorry uh, in case of uh, 0 0 1 1 there is last value but in case of 1 0 and 0 1 there is no uh, problem in the output this is 1 and this is 0 so to eliminate this 0 0 and 1 1 condition if you just uh, taking into a uh, single input and reverse invert it into the another input that is when this is 1 this is 0 and this is 0 this is 1 then becomes this uh, single output so this is known as the deep flip flop okay so this actually when d is 0 when d is 0 means j is 0 when j is 0 this is 0 uh, when j is 1 this is 1 okay j is 1 output is 1 when this is 1 uh, 0 this is 0 okay so this become 0 and this is 1 Okay, right. So actually, our target is to eliminate the struggle condition by this. And uh, next question is: Draw the full adder circuit using NAND gate. This is already discussed our regular series class. Uh, this NAND gate actually gives you the full adder circuit. Full adder, you know, this full adder. Uh, this is the carry of this full adder, and this is the sum of this full adder. Okay this actually discuss in the our series playlist of the data circuit series and this question says what is the basic difference operation of a master slip jk and jk flip flop actually in case of uh, flip flop in case of flip flop there is a race around condition what is race around condition because this output is uh, taken to the input where there is a time delay between this pulse so if this time delay is uh, is lacked by the clock pulse because the clock pulse change here so there is lag then this uh, output is changed so to remove this uh, race around condition actually in master slip flip flop uh, take these two jk flip flop and this clock is connected here and this inverted clock connected here that's mean when this part is operated this part is not operating uh, and when this part is operated this is not operating so this alternating operating gives you the uh, st uh, struggle free or, or the race around condition free output okay so this gives you actually the sort out uh, the problem in the uh, race around condition in JK flip flop. So this is actually the uh, diagram of the master slip flip flop. MS flip flop. Okay, JK flip flop. MS, MS that is the master slip JK flip flop. Flip flop. This is master slip JK flip flop. Right. Next question say why JK flip flop called one way register? Actually, within this uh, JK flip flop, there is a single bit uh, memory are used within this circuit that is 
you 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 can see these uh, two treble of the JK flip flop. That is when this is KN zero, uh, JN zero. The output is Q, and that is it's uh, it store these previous value. It store the previous value. So this is known as the one bit register. Register means this has a memory that it can store this previous value. Explain the utility of preset and clear operation in the flip flop. In this regard, actually preset and clear used in this portion of the JK flip flop. When this uh, preset is zero, then its output is one. So set the flip flop. That means the flip flop is set it. Its output gives you one. When clear is zero, this output is zero. That is, its reset. Reset means the output must be zero. So using this uh, preset uh, pre and clear, you uh, you, you can. Uh, you can reset the flip flop or you can set the flip flop. Reset means the output is zero. Set means output is one. So, what uh, value you need to store? It's it depends on this preset and clear. So that's why this is important in this one bit register configuration of the JK flip flop. Next thing is the uh, what? Uh, next question is the what is the difference between positive and negative edge triggering? Which type of triggering can be implemented using this triggering? Actually, positive triggering and negative triggering is like that. In the clock pulse change from 0 to 1, then the output change. This is called positive triggering. When the clock pulse change from 1 to 0, then output is changed. This is called negative triggering. Uh, using positive and negative triggering, we implemented the edge trigger flip flop. Using this triggering, we, we can implement the edge trigger flip flop. Okay. So I think clear about the answer of this question. We will be next uh, uh, solve the next two question in the upcoming session. This is all about me. This is my contact detail and this is my YouTube channel details. Go to the channel. If you are find favorite videos, some mathematics. Like this session, share this video, subscribe the channel, press the bell icon to get notification. So take care and meet in the next video as soon as possible. Thank you.